trust me, your mother-in-law is going to expect you to cook some cabbage when you visit. So today I've got you and you just need these ingredients. You need your cabbage, you need green pepper, your onion and your spices. Okay, so firstly you're going to slice your cabbage. Make sure that you slice, slice, slice it very thinly. Nobody wants to be chewing on thick cabbage. Look at that one. That one is a bit thick. You don't want that. So you're going to go in, go back and then slice, slice, slice. slice. You're going to go in with the green leaf. I don't know, I think I just use it because my mom likes using it. And also it adds some color to the cabbage. You know, you just want to be cooking food that looks really beautiful. You just chop, 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 chop. Then you add it to your cabbage. Okay, so I've cooked my cabbage many a times with just oil and the cabbage. And it just ends up burning. So I called my mother the other day and asked, okay, so what to do now? And she said, no, put your cabbage inside water so that it absorbs a bit of the water. Then you add your oil inside the pan. Just a little bit, guys. Maybe just a spoon of oil so that when you're cooking your cabbage, it doesn't stick to the pan. Then you want to go in and uh, drain your cabbage. Uh, drain, drain, drain. Not a lot though because if you drain it too much and your cabbage becomes dry, it defeats the whole purpose of putting it inside the water in the first place. When you're done draining it, then you're going to add your peppers and onions and take it to the stove. It's now ready to cook. Look at that. Then you add your salt, half a teaspoon of salt. I'm not using measurements, guys, because I already know how half a teaspoon looks like. Then you want to go in and use a teaspoon of raja. Add your raja, close your pot. When you come back after just... I just like mixing it together when it's hot rather than when it's cold so that's why I chose my leaf then come back then when you keep coming to check it and you realize that it's burning or maybe it's just sticking to the pot just add water just this teaspoon of water as you go guys I'm gonna now go in with my Texan spice I like my Texan spice because it's giving me me an illusion of eating meat so yeah whatever you can use any spice of your choice do you see how my cabbage is looking now it's a brown and nice so peri peri i added only because the man of the house likes everything hot so yeah i know what you're thinking but you'll do it someday as well that's how my cabbage is looking and i use the wooden spoon so that i can crush it together so that it blends in nicely then i close my pot mm -hmm. voila <laughs> there we have it there we have my cabbage guys so please subscribe like comment and share and just let me know how you cook your cabbage guys i might be missing out on something